Jambi Koikoi, Fire Mama, one of the most media personality well known, especially in the Regal Journal, passed away two days ago and uh, it's very unfortunate. We are very sorry we didn't give you the update on the right time, but there is a lot that has been said and uh, she has been battling a certain monster uh, that led to her demise after trial and after major surgeries. Welcome back to TNG. My name is Omache. Please consider subscribing and turning on the notification button so that you get notified anytime we post. And uh, ladies and gentlemen, we are very, really saddened to uh, learn the death of a well-known media personality, Faimuma Jambi Koikoi, who was especially in the reggae industry, in the reggae journal was the best MC I can say uh, in uh, maybe uh, starting from female MCs she was the best across Africa in reggae because she had a huge and massive following and of course she has been battling a monster uh, that uh, most people didn't know but uh, she, high, she came in various interviews and of course spoke about the condition and uh, the condition is called endometriosis and uh, if we can get a review of uh, this and if, uh, some overview facts because uh, it's uh, something that is maybe can be declared as a natural disaster because uh, it affects our uh, girls and the women uh, they go through a lot and that's what the uh, icon uh, Jambi Koikoi has been going uh, through and of course uh, endometriosis uh, maybe I can start with an overview uh, definition is a disease in which tissue similar to the lining of the uterus grows outside the uterus it can cause severe pain in the pelvis and make it harder to get pregnant endometriosis can start at a person's first menstrual period and last until menopause uh, that's the fact uh, and of course it causes a chronic inflammatory reaction that may result in the formation of scar tissues Adhesions, fibrosis within the pelvis and other parts of the body. Several uh, lesions types have been described. We have superficial endometriosis we found on mainly on the pelvic petroleum, a cystic ovarian endometriosis, endometromium found in the ovaries, deep endometriosis found in the rect uh, vaginal sputum, bladder and the ball. In rare cases, endometriosis has also been found outside the berries. And here are some of the symptoms. Um, some people with endometriosis don't have any symptoms. For those who do, a common symptom is pain in the lower part of the belly. Pelvis pain may be most noticeable, especially during a period or during sex or after sex when urinating or defecating. Some people also experience chronic pelvic heavy bleeding during periods or between periods. Uh, trouble getting pregnant, bloating, nausea, fatigue, depression, or anxiety. And of course, uh, uh, there are some of uh, many uh, causes of uh, this monster killer. Um, maybe if I can just look at a preview, I'm just trying to show you what really has been, uh, what uh, Jambi Kukui has been battling. And of course, uh, at present, endometriosis is thought to arise due to retrograde menstruation is when menstrual blood containing endometrial cells flows back through the fallopian tube and into the pelvic cavity at the time that the blood is flowing out of the body through the cervix and uh, uh, vagina during periods retrograde menstrual can result in endometrial like cells being deposited outside the uterus uh, where the can improve plant and grow we also have a cellular metaplasia is when cells change from one form to another cells outside the uterus change into endometrial like cells and start to grow and also number three is stem cells can give rise to the disease which then spreads through the body via blood and the lymphatic vessels for of course as you can see these are stem cells and uh, they give can rise to the disease which then spreads through the body, the stem cells. And of course, this is what one of the things that uh, Jambi said uh, affected her is that uh, these stem cells just uh, moved via blood 
um, uh, by blood and uh, lymphatic vessels and went to her lungs that usually made her to maybe uh, lungs to collapse and uh, the cells were to be transplanted or were to be removed at Atlanta Georgia in the United States and uh, that is one of the things that usually uh, made her suffer. The impact of uh, endometriosis has a significant social public health and economic implications. It can decrease the quality of life due to severe pain, fatigue, depression, anxiety and infertility. Some individuals with endometriosis experience the debilitating pain that, that prevents them from going to work or school. Pain for sex due to endometriosis can lead to interruption or avoidance of the intercourse and affect the sexual health of affected individuals and their partners addressing endometriosis will empower uh, those affected by it by supporting their human rights to the highest standard of uh, sexual and reproductive health quality of life and over well-being prevention of uh, this endometrium at present there is no way to prevent endometriosis enhanced awareness followed by early diagnosis and management may slow or halt the natural progress of the disease and reduce the long-term burden of its symptoms including possibly the risk of a uh, uh, central nervous system pain sensation currently there is no cure and of course this is the reason why uh, young uh, ladies are encouraged uh, the severe severe pains during our periods are not normal and uh, we uh, diagnosis a careful history of menstrual uh, symptom and the chronic pelvic pain provides the basis for suspecting endometriosis although several screening tools and the tests have been proposed and tested none are currently validated to accurately identify or predict individuals or population that are most likely to have the disease endometriosis can often present symptoms that mimic other conditions and contribute to the diagnostic delay. Ovarian endometrium adhesions and deep nodular forms of diseases often require ultrasonography or magnetic resonance imaging MRI to detect historic verification, usually following surgical laparoscopic visualization can be useful in confirming diagnosis particularly for the most common superficial lesion the need for historic laparoscopic confirmation should not prevent the commencement of empirical medical treatment for early diagnosis and of course the treatment of uh, this uh, monster it can be okay we can say that our treatment to manage endometriosis can vary based on the severity of symptoms and whether pregnancy is desired no treatment cure the disease a range of medication can help manage endometriosis and its symptoms non-steroid anti-inflammatory drugs and aids and uh, analgesic painkiller like ibuprofen and uh, naproxen are often used to treat pain of course you had a uh, jumpy uh, speaking of uh, this once hormonal medication like a gnrh analysis analogues and uh, contraceptive birth control methods can also help control pain these methods include pills hormonal in uh, intra uh, trino, uh, devices are you this you know that vaginal rings implants injections patches uh, these methods may not be suitable for those wanting to get pregnant you see that is an ineffective fertility medicine and procedures are sometimes used for those having difficulty getting pregnancy because of endometriosis surgery sometimes used to remove endometriosis lesions addition and scar tissues the process uh, laparoscopic surgery using a small camera to visualize inside the body allows doctor to keep incision small and of course this is what uh, really uh, jambi used to went through various surgeries he went over 10 surgeries and more more again and again um discuss your treatment option with a health care provider and of course that is very crucial and also raising awareness can help people to diagnose early because as you see jam pikoiko was one was a champion of endometriosis especially in uh, transvia county the other day she was there and championing uh, this thing saying that the government should declare it as a national disaster in addition uh, to talking to their doctor 
people may find additional advice and emotional assistance in local patient support. And of course, there are challenges and priorities and uh, other responses from uh, uh, organizations just as World Health Organization. So this is what really uh, Jambi Kuikoi Fayamama uh, went through. She was the best in the mic, but she was really going through a lot because sometimes she will perform after a, period, a few periods of time, you will hear her coughing, uh, but uh, it was a condition that she was really battling. And of course, we pray that uh, may God keep her uh, strengthening her family and uh, as uh, she keep resting peace, as burial arrangements and everything are ongoing, we'll be keeping you updated. Keep subscribing on TNG Media Kenya. My name is Omache, and of course, to the reggae lovers and uh, fans to Fire Mama, we say may God comfort everybody. The country is burning, and of course, it's a gap, but she fought a good uh, fight, and uh, may she rest in peace. My name is Omache. Let's meet to the next video. Please consider subscribing and turning on the notification button.